and kiss our display. Mystery Wheel Races. Motorized Wooden Railway. Team Percy. New Percy. Old Percy. Percy Express. Toby. Team James. Victor. Gray Wheel James. New James. And James Express. Team Thomas. New Thomas. Thomas Express. Old Thomas. Snowy Thomas. Team Brio. Daylight. Pennsylvania Torpedo. Big Red. Real Metro Rider. Hero of the Rails. Hero. Gordon. Spencer. And Diesel. And Team Purpley Pink. Charlie, Lady, Rosie, and Salty. Brio. Ooh, Pennsylvania. Ooh, Team James. Ooh, Express. And Team Thomas. I knew you were gonna pick him. I wanted all our races to be racers to be backwards. All of our racers can go forwards or backwards, so let's race them backwards. Thomas, James, and the Pennsylvania Torpedo racing backwards. Ready, set, go! They're off, and it looks like the Pennsylvania Torpedo is definitely in the lead here. It looks like James and Thomas Express are almost nose to nose. Definitely with the Pennsylvania Torpedo though, as we go into the hill climb, we'll see if he can climb the hill backwards, and he has no problem whatsoever. He's the first on the gold track, as both James and Thomas are having problems, and now Pennsylvania Torpedo's having problems. They might need a little bit of help here, and they're gonna get a little bit of help here, and we'll give Torpedo a little bit of help as well. Oh, but he's having nothing but problems. Oh, wow, look at him go. Racing these guys backwards was not the best idea. Let's get James up here as well. Going back downwards now, who will be the first to cross? It is Thomas, James is in second, and Pennsylvania Torpedo is kind of, he just doesn't even want help. All three engines needing help with the hill climb, but Thomas wins overall. Oh, Team Brio again. I choose Daylight. Daylight? Yeah. Yoink. Ooh, Percy. Percy Express. Percy Express? Yeah. You got it. Hero of the Rails. You want Hero? Yeah. You Hero of the Rails, Percy Express, and Daylight. Any predictions here, William? Daylight. You think Daylight? I'm gonna go with Hero. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready, and four to go! And they're off, and it looks like neck and neck and neck. Wow, really close race here. I think maybe Percy Express has a little bit of a lead. He does now. Hero coming in second, Daylight third. As Percy is the first to get the hill climb. Let's see how he does it. He's doing very well. He keeps on going on. Looks like Daylight might need a little bit of help, as Hero's definitely in second. Percy doesn't struggle up to the very top, though. He will come down. Will he be the first to cross the line? He is. Hero of the rails will come in second. And Daylight, not needing any assistance after all, comes in third. A little bit better with the engines going forward, but in the end, it is Percy Express. Percy. Toby. You want Toby? James. Victor Rules. Victor? And Brio again. The Brio Metroliner? Toby. Victor, Metroliner. William, any predictions? Metroliner. You think Metroliner? Yeah. I'm gonna go with Toby. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready, and four to... Go! They're off. And it looks like Metroliner has a little bit of a lead over Toby. Victor coming in third. Yeah, I'd definitely say that Brio is in the lead here. We'll see what happens once they do the hill climb. Victor is falling back now, folks. Coming into third, most definitely. As they hit the hill climb, it looks like Brio has... Toby has shortened the lead, it looks like, between him and Brio. Brio definitely a little bit ahead, though. Victor in a distant third. Good hill climbing. We'll see what happens as they go downhill. Oh, Brio shoots ahead for the win. Toby comes in second, and Victor needs some more work done at the Steamworks. An interesting race run by Toby here, but in the end, Brio will go on. James. I choose gray wheel day. Learning curve gray wheel. Wow, look at that. It's part of the Thomas, though. I choose snow cover Thomas. Snow cover? Yeah. Purple. I choose Rosie. Rosie? Three learning curve engines as it's James, Snowy Thomas, and Rosie. Liam, any predictions? You think Rosie? 
I'm gonna go with James. I like those gray wheels of his. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready, and four to go. They're off, and it looks like Rosie and James are having a little bit of a lead. With James coming out ahead of Rosie, Snowy Thomas coming in third. Definitely looks like Gray Wheel James is in the lead. Uh huh, has a full train length ahead. And Snowy Thomas is coming in, but James, it looks like he has a little bit of a problem with the hill climb. Rosie, however, has no problem. Will Snowy Thomas, Snowy Thomas is having a little bit of issue, but he is getting up there. Rosie keeps on keeping on. Gray Wheel James might need a little bit of a push. As Rosie's at the top of the hill already, she has passed everyone's expectations and will go on to win the race. Snowy Thomas, good deceleration down the hill, comes in second. And Gray Wheel James, great on the straightaway, but he needed a lot of help. Wow, look at this. James was definitely in the lead, far and away, but in the end, it is Rosie who was able to climb the hills and successfully win the race. James, I think your choice is new James. Team purpley pink. Charlie. Charlie? Ooh, and Team Percy. You want new Percy? Yeah. You got it. New James, new Percy, and Charlie. William, any predictions? You think new Percy? Yeah. I'm gonna go with Charlie. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready, and four to go. Off they go. It looks like James had a little bit of a lead, but he is done now. Charlie taking a commanding lead over Percy. James coming in third. I wonder what will happen here once we start doing the hill climb. Oh, Charlie, is he going to make it? No, he's struggling up the hill, folks, but he manages to do it just a little bit ahead of Percy as James is definitely in third. We keep on keeping on. Charlie makes it to the top. Will he have enough to decelerate before Percy catches up to him? And I think he will, and Charlie goes on. Percy comes in second, and new James will come in a distant third. A well-fought race by our engines, but in the end, it is Charlie, number 14, that moves ahead. Thomas? Who's Thomas? You want old Thomas? Purple pink. Lady? You got it, buddy. And hero of the rails. You want diesel? Learning curve, Thomas, Lady, and Diesel. Liam, any predictions? Do you think Lady's gonna do it? I'm gonna go with Lady as well. I think she'll do it. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready, and four to go. They're off. Wow, Lady, right off the bat. Just as both of us predicted, it looks like Diesel is coming in second with Thomas coming in third. Definitely Lady just well ahead of the competition here. Well, she gets stuck on that first hill. It looks like she is struggling and she's having some problems. Diesel overtakes her. Oh, no, no, he's having problems. Thomas is having problems. Liam, look at this. All three engines are having problems. Why don't you grab that stick? We'll give all three of them a boost at the same time. Nice and even. Let's see if we can just give them all a nice boost at the same time. And get them up there and see what happens. And here we go. And Lady resumes her lead. Will she have problems making it up the second phase? No, she's managed to do it as Diesel struggles on. Thomas also struggles. Lady manages to make that second hill. We'll go on. Diesel stuck in second and Thomas stuck in third just spinning his wheels. What an odd race as all three engines got stuck on the first hill. Lady though managed to negotiate the second hill and we'll go on to the next race. Team Thomas. I know who your choice is gonna be. New Thomas. Ooh, Team Purple Pink. Yar, you old salt doggy. The Dockside Diesel. Hero of the Rails. You want Spencer? Yeah. Mattel Fisher Price lineup. Here we have Thomas, Spencer, and Salty. The race nobody asked for. William, any predictions? Salt. Salty? I'm going with Thomas. I think Thomas will do it this time. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready, and four to go. They're off. It looks like Salty has a little bit of a lead. What happened? Was Thomas off track there? Spencer is now taking the lead over Salty as Thomas got back on track. Actually, a rather close race, all things considered, considering these last races have been very one-sided. Will Spencer have any problems going up the hill? No, he doesn't. Salty is coming in second. Thomas will be in third as we enter the second hill. It looks like Spencer maintains his lead and gets to the top first. He will come down. 
Salty maintains his second spot. Will Thomas have any chance to overtake him? No, he won't. Spencer goes on. Salty comes in second. Thomas in third. Well, neither of us picked Spencer, and joke's on us. Spencer, on to the next round. Final race of the first round has Learning Curve Percy, Big Red from Brio, and Gordon. And they will be racing against each other. William, any predictions on this race? Percy. You think Percy's going to do it? I'm going to go with Big Red. I think Big Red will do it. 512 for the money, 6 for the show, 4 to get ready. And Liam says... Go! They're off. And it looks like Gordon has an early lead. None of us picked Gordon. Big Red coming in a slight second over Percy, but Gordon is the story here, folks. None of us thought that he would make it. Let's see how he does on that first hill. That'll be the big tail. Is he slowing down? No, he's conquered it. As Big Red is having problems, and so is Percy. Wow, our two predictions is Gordon is climbing the second hill already. And he's going down the big, long decline and will go on to win. Learning curve, Percy struggling up the hill. And Big Red not even moving at all. Well, it turns out Liam and I are terrible at predictions as the one engine we thought would not win totally was the only engine that could make it up both hills. Good job, Gordon. Going into the second round competitions, Team James has been eliminated. Interesting to note, Team Purple Pink has three contestants, while Hero of the Rails has two, the rest of the teams only with one. Ooh, Team Purple Pink. Rosie. Rosie? Yeah. Brio. Brio Metroliner. And Team Thomas. Looks like it's Thomas Express. We have Thomas Express. Learning Curve Rosie and Brio Metroliner. William? Metroliner. Do you think Metroliner? Yeah. I think that Metroliner will also do well. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready, and four to... Go! They're off, and it looks like Thomas Express might have a little bit of a lead. Now it's a big lead. Brio coming in second with Rosie in a slight third. But the real story here is Thomas Express. Let's see if he can climb this. No, he's having problems on the hill. What a commanding lead, but Brio has no problems. Rosie now has a little bit of issue, but she'll get up. And they have both passed Thomas Express as Brio Metroliner. Now makes it to the top of the second hill. He is known for his ability to descend well and will go on to the next round, eliminating Rosie, who has come in second. And it looks like the miniature Arsdale engines are helping out Thomas Express, but it's not enough. And he's, oh, skid. Nice. And it's a huge win for Brio with the Metro Liner. Oh, purple. Which of these purple engines do you want? Charlie. Charlie. Oh, Hero of the Rails. Gordon or Spencer, which of these big tender engines, William? You're choosing Gordon? Yeah. You got it. Percy. I think we all know who the Percy choice is going to be. Here's our three, Gordon, Percy Express, and Charlie. One from each era of Motorized Railway. William, who is your choice? Gordon. I'm also going to go with Gordon this time. He surprised both of us last time, so let's see how he does this time. Six for the money, 14 for the show, four to get ready, and three, two. Go! They are off, and it looks like it's neck and neck and neck. Oh, it looks like maybe Percy Express is having a little bit of a lead now. Coming in... With Charlie might have a little bit about Gordon, but it's definitely Percy Express. Is he going to have any problems? No, he has no problems climbing that first hill. Gordon has now come in second with Charlie in third. As we go to the second hill, it looks like Percy is still going in the commanding lead. He will go on and he makes it into the final. Gordon and Charlie now are duking it out for second. And wow, that was almost a tie. Percy Express climbing the hills like neither James nor Thomas could. Our final race of the second round has Spencer and Lady, but we need a third engine. So Liam, I have an idea. Let's spin the wheel one more time and see who comes up and we'll pick from that house. Oh, and you picked James. Wow, how rare. All of Team James has been eliminated in the first round, as a matter of fact. Who's your pick from Team James? Victor! Victor? Yeah! I knew you were going to pick Victor. Let's go, Neuro Gauge. You're all silver steam, Spencer. What? I do Hoodie! Who do you- I'm a magical engine. Liam, who do you think is going to make it to the final out of these three engines? Spencer! You think Spencer? I'm going to go with Lady. I think that she's got all the magic and she's got what it takes to win this race. Lady for the money. Spencer to show. Victor to get ready. And Liam says... Go! Off they are, and it looks like neck and neck and neck, but Lady takes an early lead with Spencer in second, and Gordon comes in, or sorry, Victor rather, in third. 
Butch now passing with Kevin, but here comes Lady. Will she have enough to climb? She struggles a bit on that first hill, but Spencer has caught up. Victor in a distant third now. Let's see how she does on the second hill. Will it be enough for Spencer to overtake her? It is. Spencer has overtaken Lady. Will it be enough for the finish? And no, Lady does go on. Finished or seconded by Spencer as Victor will come in third. What a close race between Spencer and Lady. Lady has problems climbing the hills, but she has no problems going down. Spencer, good at climbing hills, not on the grid on the straightaways, rather. And Victor should probably just stay in the steamworks. And here we have it, folks, the final race. Percy Express, Learning Curve Lady, and Brio Metro Liner. This will be for the title. Liam, do you have any predictions? Brio Metro Liner. You think Brio's gonna do it? Yeah. I'm gonna go with Percy this time. I think Percy Express will have what it takes to win it all. The brawl to settle it all. Percy for the money, Lady for the show, Brio to get ready, and hey, William says go. they are off. And it looks like Lady is taking an early lead, but she has problems climbing those hills. Metro Liner in third as Percy, a close second behind Lady, maybe neck and neck now. I think he might overtake her. As they get to the first hill, that is what all that tells the tale as Percy will go on. Metro Liner now, no problems passing Lady, but the real story here is Percy Express as he will go on in a definitive way to win it all. <coughs> Metro Liner coming in second. Sir Robert Normanby and his horse here with the trophy giving it to Percy from the Express. Backwards forwards Percy in just an explosive win. Very dominant overall. Hey guys, click here to watch another video and click here to subscribe to our channel. Bye!